up everyone, two of the ape here. Now that ScarQuest is on mobile beta testing, let's take a look at the app and some gameplay. Just loading up real quick, just like that. Go ahead and start. And as you can see, looks very similar to from when we were on the PC, but now I'm holding it right here in my hands. Pretty cool. Let's go ahead and start a battle. Begin combat. Gearing up, this um, cinematic edit is actually an actual cinematic edit of the battle that I'm about to have. Fun fact. Starting up, let's see, I'm going to throw in this character first, which is more of a tank. Then I'm going to throw in this one, which only attacks the buildings. So that one will just go straight past the troops, straight for the building. This white character here shoots this beam right off the get-go, so I'm going to save her for a, later on. I'm going to send another one of these troops in to attack the building. Send some of these DPS. Like I said, I'm saving this laser beam one. You'll see what I'm talking about. Send some troops on the other side. Alright, next thing I'm going to try to do is get another tank in there. Trying to get those tanks up ahead so they can take the damage. Let's throw another tank there. I must say, it is so cool being able to hold the ScarQuest game in my phone. I can just open up the app wherever I'm at and just play a quick match. And no problemo. Okay, let me not let me throw the laser beam on here now. There we go. So, you know, certain troops really do work a lot better in certain moments so getting to know the characters and then when you're editing the deck you can take a look at the different kind of attributes or whether they're more of a tank more of a DPS I'll showcase that in a different video got that nice victory got a chest to open up and yeah just like that